June is Alzheimer's and Brain Awareness Month. Health experts say that Alzheimer's is a growing disease across the country, including here in North Carolina. WXI 12's Louis Tran spoke to leaders with the Alzheimer's Association in the triad on what you should watch for in case your loved ones could be affected. Leaders with the organization say that more than 180,000 people across the state are impacted by this disease. Across the U.S., more than 6 million. Now, while the disease is growing across the U.S., so is their knowledge on what you should watch for. Alzheimer's is a progressive brain disease. Officials say it's one type of dementia, but the most common in the U.S. While there's no data on what causes this, experts say that there are several risk factors. Age is the primary one. The risk increases as we get older. If the disease runs in your family, that also increases your risk. And if you have a deterministic gene of the disease, the risk of getting it increases substantially. Experts also shared symptoms you should watch for in your loved ones, including memory loss, like asking the same questions over and over, or becoming forgetful to the point it disrupts their normal life, having a difficult time completing familiar tasks, and feeling confused about the time and place. If your loved one is diagnosed with the disease, leaders with the Alzheimer's Association say your loved one is still the same person and it should not change how you treat them. An Alzheimer's di diagnosis doesn't define them. So, you know, yes, it is life changing, but many people living with the disease say that their diagnosis doesn't change who they are. So they want to continue to still do activities and do things that they enjoy and stay engaged with their family and friends for as long as possible. The organization will host a local event to support families impacted by Alzheimer's disease. It'll take place on June 25th in Kernersville. For more information, I'll have more details in this story on our website. In Winston-Salem, I'm Louis Tran, WXII 12 News.